Hey guys and gals, you know who it is, and there's been even more Just Cause 4 leaks. A uh, German website released several new images, and I'm gonna jump right into it. This looks amazing. We've got a, a better render of the Just Cause, I guess official Just Cause 4 logo, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we got a better shot of the trees here and the lightning strike through that 4 looks amazing. Um, we're starting off nice and slow, okay? There is there's much better screenshots, but I wanna start off nice and slow, and we got a really good front render of Rico. He's looking a little more worse for wear compared to some of the other games. I wonder if there's a potential for, you know, if you get hit, that hit stays with you, I guess. So if you take a bullet, say, to the shoulder, then your shoulder's going to be wearing that that scar for a while until it until it heals up. Some sort of uh, dynamic uh, pain system, I suppose. Uh, we still got those yellow tinges over here. He's looking a little bit younger. I don't know if that's just me. Anyway, moving on, we have a really good shot of, this looks a little bit pre-alpha, I'm not gonna, not gonna lie, it looks still work in progress. We have some sort of junkyard bridge of some sort. It looks overgrown, so maybe this part of the map's been abandoned. Similar to the, the Just Cause 3 land DLC, we have that entire new Lacrima Island. It's completely abandoned, except for, you know, when the Black Hand showed up and ruined everything. Um, it's very patchwork and it's definitely overgrown and it's got a little platform here maybe for, for uh, base jumping you remember uh, far cry 4 had that river that went from the very top of the map to the very bottom you could wingsuit all the way down it looked really cool i wonder if there's going to be similar situation with uh just cause 4 here showing off some of the uh landscape over here we got nice variation always good because just cause 4 is just cause series it's known to really use verticality in their um, game design instead of just being really flat and open um, another render still 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 a little rough around the edges but trust me we still got we got four very good screenshots coming up after this uh, Rico is taking down a helicopter with what looks to be it looks very similar to the fire leech from just cause 3 can't wait to try this out. Um, that definitely looks like a weapon attachment there, some sort of laser. So, I don't know, is, is, there, is there weapon a customization in this game? I don't know, you tell me. What do you think? Uh, showing off the destruction physics as always, just cause Theories has always been known to actually blow apart vehicles instead of them just becoming like a, a husk that you can't interact with. Uh, showing off the lush green around as well. Nice, nice tall trees as always. Um, this is the good shot. This is the money shot right here. This is the, the fantastic full image of that steam leak that I covered just before. And this looks insane. There's a tornado, which hints at potentially a dynamic weather system. That's more than just, you know, rain and sunshine or thunderstorms. Uh, we have a really big jet over here. Jet. Really big plane over here really hope that's as fun to use as the cargo pl cargo plane from just cause 3 we're fully weaponized helicopter over here very large city similar to the just cause 2 uh we look like there's some sort of temple down here next to a waterfall and I, I really i really like that sort of aspect where just cause sort of does the it, it was it was uh, prominent in just cause 3 where they had old old style buildings mixed with uh the new military stuff i really like that and i hope they continue with that uh maybe I don't know, maybe this is like a uh, representation of the old, I'm not even going to get into that, that's not my, that's not my specialty at all. Um, got some mountains over here in the background, uh, even over here, even the hills, we got some more over here as well. I'm not sure, is that a really, is that a really big temple or is that just a, a, a cliff face? Can't actually, can't actually tell. I don't know, it looks sort of like a temple, I don't know. I don't know, I'll, I'll leave that, I'll leave that up to you guys, what do you think, what do you guys think? A uh, really, really large flat waterfall. I'm, I'm gonna go straight off the bat here and say maybe that's where you fight someone. Is because that definitely looks like some sort of, um, you know, how the volcano was basically center point around Just Cause Three. I wonder if that's gonna be the center point around Just Cause Four. Uh, some really, really nice valley. I really like that sort of valley where the surrounding land sort of goes up just a little bit and then it just drops into a valley. Um. Thunder and lightning everywhere. This is gonna be like a very chaotic game, I can tell already. Uh, we got a better version of the Titan enemy from Just Cause 3. And what's even better is he looks like he's got some sort of exo uh, exoskeleton, exo arm of some kind. 
And I don't know if, if it's just me, but that, that looks very similar to the grappler. But I don't know if that's just because it's just a circle. Um, we got ballistic padding up the wazoo here. He's holding a weapon, which looks very similar to the Thunderbird EMP from Just Cause 3. Because of that, that canister down there. So I wonder if that does something similar. Uh, very slick military base. I wonder if that's actually a, a prison in the background. Or maybe some sort of center comm control tower because of the satellite here. I don't know. And it's it's in a, it's up against the mountains a little bit. I wonder if that's over here. Actually, it could be. You see that little doorway there? That thing? That looks sort of, that looks very similar to that. Holy crap. I didn't see that the first time. Probably not, but I don't, I don't, I don't know. Um, this game looks, looks big and it looks impressive. This is a, this is, this looks oh, so good. I'm assuming Rico is driving a muscle car next to uh, a river. And we just got a tornado ripping through the landscape here. Just casually. Really, really impressive mountainscape. Loving those god rays. This game is going to be big. It's showing off the uh, the render distance. Remember the... The... The mountain from Just Cause 3. It, was, it wasn't always in focus because of how... You know, game game engine limits and all that. It, it wasn't always the most detailed looking mountain from far away. I really hope they fix that in this game. I really hope it looks more detailed than Just Cause 3. And then, best for last, Rico wingsuiting in, destroying a base, and more or less confirming weapon weapon customization. That's red, but that's yellow. I don't know, that, lo that looks like weapon customization to me. I wasn't sure about the yellow theme that um, Rico was rocking in this game, but actually it's growing on me after seeing this wingsuit. That looks really good. Uh, I'm not sure, those, those look like weather balloons. I'm not sure what those are, but it's a, a, a medium-sized base. It's not big, but it's not, it's not, 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 too, not too small. And it looks, is that a runway or like a turn or like a car, road turnaround? Is that a runway or a road turnaround? I'm not sure. Got, we've still got those large radio towers that you, it looks like you can destroy. I love those from Jessica's 3. You just like shoot the base and it comes tumbling down. Anyway, that's that's going to be it for me, guys. I don't want to I don't want to take too, too much of your time. just want to keep you guys up to date. Uh, subscribe for more because I'm going to be on all of these Just Cause 4 leaks immediately. I'm going to be covering everything as soon as it comes out. So uh, subscribe for that and I'll see you guys later. Peace.